Hello. Just gonna do. Oh, I might as well open up Baldur's Gate. Gonna hang out for a minute. That's pretty loud. I don't really know what to expect with this game, honestly. Um, let me do a thing and then we'll do character creation. I'm not sure if this game is going to be better with a controller or a keyboard. I guess we'll decide. Once we get to that point, first we have to pick a, a race and a class, and then uh, after that, we'll decide how we want to play, I suppose.
starting again. I'm back. So I looked around at Character Creator yesterday, but Kayla told me that she didn't want me to play it in front of her, and she doesn't want to watch me play it because she thinks I'm going to play it bad. And by bad, she just means not the decisions that she would want to make and decisions in this, like, super affect how the rest of your game goes, I guess. So she doesn't want to see what the options are, and she doesn't want to see the way that I play it, so I have to play it while she's at work. So... But I was looking at the character creator, and uh, I think I'm going to do balance, and oh, I didn't watch this. Oh, my beard is really tangly right now. Why are you 
you so tangly. Ooh, that seems suboptimal. Although, if it gave you powers, I'd probably do it. So I can't really judge. I probably don't want that on my eye. I would guess. So I decided on Dragonborn Blue. With the class Sorcerer. With the cantrips, Acid Splash, Blade Ward, Fire Bolt, and Bone Chill. The spells Chromatic Orb and Magic Missile. The subclass Draconic with the dragon ancestor gold for fire this guy's self seems pretty cool and fire spells are gonna be pretty good i mean fireball a classic firebolt the cantrip both very strong not really sure how stacked that gets Lightning would be really good, so like, if I did gold and got fire breath, and then blue for lightning, but you don't get, oh yeah you do. You get Witch Bolt, which is pretty sweet, but I think Disguise Self will be more fun. And that affects a cantrip, so that's what I believe we're gonna go with. The background... See, I'm not really sure, because... It's probably going to be decently balanced between combat and role play. So this gives insight and religion. My current ones are... Arcana and Persuasion. So we need... Deception and stealth could be good, but I don't want to be a criminal. We'll go charlatan, I suppose. And then I do want to...
I don't know how easy it is to get these. But we'll do... Thirteen, ten, ten. That leaves me with eight left, yeah? Uh, so we'll do twelve. We don't need strength at all. I fuck with this. This should give me... This should give me 18 with 16... For a female voice to I liked I liked this one I liked this one I liked this and then I liked this really blue blue Uh, I did the serpents because they're pretty chill. Slightly different colored eyes. to be more muted. That works. And then I'm gonna go with this gold. And then I think it was this tail that I liked. Yeah, there we go. I'm still going to name her Ion. Oh, I don't want to proceed yet. I want to... No, 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 no. Go back, back, back. I want to change Arcana to... Insight? I guess Intimidation. What's Arcana? Arcana might be good too. Fuck it, I guess let's go with Arcana. Yeah, who knows? Sixteen is already plus two. Okay. Uh, 
two left. Oh, well, that was expensive. Wow, that's really expensive, too. You're going to be really dumb, really weak, kind of wise. This works for me. You need a guardian. Choose one. Oh, I need a guardian now. Huh. Should make a really cracked melee. Oh, does it not tell me? Oh, no, it doesn't. I don't get to pick whatever thingy they are. Um, It's randomizing their race and everything. Okay. So I'm not sure how much this matters. But I do want to go with this version of Tiefling, I think. Mm. Elves are super duper cracked, though. Tattoo. Messy hair is pretty cool. I'm gonna go orange one. 
Alright. Fuck it. <clears throat> I'm sure that'll probably work itself out. You could probably handle it. Oh no, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Everybody just wants to be consumed by the Elithid flying ship. Ooh, Dragon Riders. He seems unconcerned, yeah. I want an Eldritch Horror flying ship. That shit is awesome. Ugh, failed your ability check there, huh? Overall, it seems like that went well. Home sweet home. Page up, page down to zoom in and out. Always dab the 
for playing D&D related games. Quick save and quick load. Oh, so that you can uh, like retcon your decisions. We're not gonna do any of that though. We are gonna live with the consequences that we've made. We're gonna be chaotic neutral. So we're gonna, for the most part, just do the most interesting option to me. Whichever one I think will have the most like interesting outcome. Not necessarily like, good or evil, just the most interesting one. The most, I don't know, chaotic, for lack of a better word. And then maybe we'll do like a, a paladin playthrough where, where we do like the objectively good, lawful good option. So we can be first person. All of our options there. Consumables. Oh, we can do a non-lethal. Okay, interesting. Action, action. So, everything I can do is an action. These are bonuses. Ah, bonus sections are red. Okay. Alright. Journal, combat log, short rest. Turn base mode. You've entered turn-based mode. The game has paused around you and time is broken down into rounds that represent six seconds each. Turn-based mode can be used to avoid traps, perils, or being spotted. I don't think I necessarily want to be in turn-based mode now. Let's look at the character sheet. So we have an alchemy pouch, a supply pack, Keychain, potion, revivify, quarter staff, sorcerer robe, underwear, simple boots, homely clothes, tasteful boots. Oh, did I set it to. I think I set it to no nudity mode, but I need to make sure. What's the Twitch extension?
Camera shake off. Leave that fine. Show genitals off. Okay. Show cinematic nudity off. Share private moments off. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Uh, Some dialogue options require a skill check. A dice roll that must meet or exceed a target number. Your character's skills add a bonus to this roll. Uh oh. Good roll, nice. The casing is fragile. The slightest touch could cause it to crumble. Okay, we won't do that, because that's probably going to be bad. still be stuck inside if we hadn't been attacked. Someone else got, might be other survivors. Wonder who was inside. Maybe. I'm gonna this reach in the, the pool thing. That thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind yeah, your in. eye. Is that these things? Made it out. Someone else got out. One player dead. Take the bullet still. Dead. Good. Not getting back in that thing. I mean, I would if it would heal me, honestly. Sphincter. In we go. Goblin. Loot him. A schematic of a nautiloid flashes into your mind. Nerves, sinews. As much living being as ship. Cool. to save us from this place from this place you'll free us 
Maybe. The exposed brain quivers in expectation. Please. Before they return! They return. A newborn. Born new from this husk. You know no creature like this. One that is more brain than person. Remove us from this body. From this case. Free us. Please. Uh, expose. Oh, I'm gonna... Oh, it's not bad. Nice. So far, good rolls. You notice a demon. A swelling of the brain, causing pressure where it strains against the shell of the skull. Uh, let's do decks, I guess. Come on, baby. Failed. Absolutely ruin it. Just yoink it out. The brain won't budge. Ah, uh, the only thing I have left to do is destroy it. I guess I'll destroy it. Trying to run and going into the third person mode. Abomination. This is your end. I prefer if it wasn't. Your head throbs and your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh! My head! What is this? Oh, you got a brainworm too. Squaw. You are no thrall. Flacketh blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. We carry mind flayer parasites. Unless we escape, unless we are cleansed, our bodies and minds will be tainted and twisted. That Within cool. days, we will be geich, mind flayers. Returning into mind flayers, there must be something we can do. We can do nothing until we escape. That must be our priority. First. We exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. We will address the matter of a cure for this infection once we reach the material plane. Combat happens in rounds, and each participant gets a turn to act. The game pauses around you during combat, so you have time to plan your actions. So 
so... I see how many uh, two spell slots. Gotcha. Oh, you can only do that once a short rest, once a long rest. Astral knowledge, second wind. Miss Victory away. Ah, shit. You bow or you break. <laughs> You proved surprisingly adequate in battle. Now, adequate. to the helm. Healing things. I can make no sense of it. Man isn't dead, but he's totally unresponsive. Man isn't. Let me help! Get me out of this damn thing! We have no time for stragglers. from the console near to the pod. Are you satisfied? We need to go. The construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a stranger? I mean, yeah, maybe.
the console appears dormant. The console hums to life. its purpose it could do anything I want to touch it suddenly you feel a hideous squirming in your head the parasite then discomfort fades and another sensation washes over you connection authority Literally can't fail this. You feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and yield to it. A Dope. shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch <coughs> each other's backs along the way. I did. It must be because of those parasites they put in us. But that'll have to wait. Are we going to help each other or not? Shadowheart. Yeah. One moment. Was that? It's nothing. Trust me. Enough. I don't trust chatter. you at all. We need to get to the helm now. She's right. Lead on. She got a bunch of XP, and we got like no XP. That doesn't seem fair. Ouch. I think. flickers in his eyes, but he seems totally unaware of his surroundings. Faint images appear in your mind. A brain, a Git Yankee warrior, and centuries of darkness. of souls that's the sphincter we came on I think no that's the sphincter we came on uh, I guess we'll do this one we are nearing the helm once inside do as I say. Who put you in charge? I'll trust my own judgment. Kenyank. That's the right way. We're gonna go the wrong way first. Let's see what's in this finger. Something the matter. Besides the obvious, that is. I'm right behind. Where'd that guy go? You are beautiful. Thanks.
it would seem quite a few. Another brain. Hmm. This might unlock those controls next to the pod. This. As you place your hand on the pod, you hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. Change how? Doesn't seem that bad. Before it's our turn. Can I do it again? It's already finished. The newborn mind flayer stares at you, weak and dazed. Can I kill it? The newborn. I guess not. Are watching me. I'll give it a shot. Odd things. I don't know what plane they're from. We're all full health. We all were full health. Ooh, that's bad. Gotta watch your face, bro. Especially around mine for you. We should do some murder. No traps, please. No time to waste. Of course it didn't kill. Oops. Misses. Ah! 
thought. Try the guiding bolt again. Actually, let's go. Yeah, we'll just do the guiding bolt again. Of course, it misses. Slots. In of course, he saved. Oh, I'm Shit about dead. Ground, we're dead. Potion of healing. sure what that did but seems good Tormentor! 
like the shove animation is really good. at miss. I don't know if these guys are friendly or not.
swift as my feet can carry me. Oh wow, did that kill in one hit? Yeah, it did. No, fuck. I keep pushing Y. Might as well. Forward. Before more dragons come. The Helm's alien transponder. You've made it in time. I thought those dudes were my friends because they were killing Blair. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Other than the infection, you're more or less intact. A miracle, given everything you've been through. But it'll all be for nothing if you don't find help soon. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. Go to your personal chest in a camp during a long rest to find some of your unique DLC items. Who 
we've escaped the hells on the Nautiloid and crashed somewhere back in the material plane. We need to explore the area and find a healer. have seen better days more of those wretched things can I see my carry capacity Fresh water. There must be a settlement somewhere nearby. So... At the ready. too far away from your character. Oh, those things are alive. Better stay back. One strike could be lethal. Okay, well, I guess I can't go that way. Something's on my mind. Oh, how did I not find her the first time? I'm gonna reach for the artifact. What are you doing? I'm alive, yes. Thank you for the concern. And speaking of... How are we alive? I remember the ship. <coughs> I remember falling. Then nothing. You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. Looks like she ran off without us. 
you're more concerned for her than she is for you, clearly. We need to take care of ourselves. First things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. We need each other, and we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. Lead the way. Okay, well, I guess we should look harder for our other party member. See if we can find her. Moving ahead. What's inside? No traps, please. Still kind of want to try and kill those things. Fresh water. There must be a settlement somewhere nearby. I suppose we'll just go in the settlement. The intellect of ours are just gonna instantly one tap me. Go into the settlement. Let's see what this does. We can get that open easily. Maybe there's another entrance. Two-handed, two-handed. Sure, I'll throw my necklace. Did that happen? My faith protects me. No. 
to meet your maker. Oh, she's gonna die. Better stay back. One strike could be lethal. There's more. Wow, you're so lucky you didn't die. It's gonna kill me. Oh, it didn't kill me. Critical miss. in such a distant prospect. What a welcome rest. May the gods take you first. Oh, ouch. Set enemies. Mm. 
Anything of use? Wits and blades always sharp. Better take a look. I have a lot on my mind. And, well, in it. Should mind my step. I have something to ask. You strike me as the reliable sort. But are you sure this is a good idea? There are lit fuses in our heads. Sooner or later, they're going to blow. Each hour that passes, the thing inside us grows. We need to find a healer. Let's wake up at first light. Maybe we'll get lucky. We're overdue some good fortune. Rest well. We'll need our strength. Here we go. not the world you know. Rest feels impossible, no matter how heavy your eyes become. Every time they flicker shut, the tadpole seems to twitch behind them. Dragons, gears, and the hells themselves have come after you. Yet it is this creature that lingers in your skull. Focus on that spot of pain from when it slipped behind your eye to where it now lurks. You cannot prod it, but you can make it clear that you are watching. What is there to fear when it is the one stuck inside you? It is a minor victory, but enough to soothe you to sleep. It's pretty cool. Oh. All right, well, at least I have my spell slots back. There seems completely on fire. What's in here?
I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Sure. There. Can you see it? I don't really trust this guy, but whatever. If you want to keep that darling neck of yours. And you, keep your distance. No need for this to get messy. I need her alive. Stow that blade or I'll show you just how messy things can get. Ah, promises, promises. But I have other business, I'm afraid. Now, I saw you on the ship, didn't I? Nod. Oh, I'm definitely going to fail. Yep. Oh, I passed. Hell yeah. <clears throat> you wretched little... <sighs> Unfamiliar eyes prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on? I'm not an idiot. It has to be those tentacled monsters. Something they did. They took you too. I saw it during whatever just happened. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. I'm out of wine and flowers, so I hope an introduction will suffice. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Is that so? We clearly <laughs> move in different circles. Turn us into... <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? <coughs> Although, it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Come you know, me. I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And you seem like a useful person to know. I am, of course, the All protagonist. Right. I accept. <coughs> Lead on. <coughs> Level up. <coughs> Jeez, my health went way up. Sorcery points. New spell and two passives. Ooh, can add class.
charm person might be good. Shield is handy. I guess we'll go try in person. And we'll go twinned and distant. Those are the ones I took in. So you know, inflict wounds, guiding bolts, healing word, shield of faith. I suppose we could give you... Bless. Do you already have bless? No, you didn't. How come you get a level? Dash disengage. You don't get anything. Here. Cost one sorcery point per spell slot you level used. Cantrips cost one. For spells that don't shoot a projectile, the target needs to be close enough together. And then it put distant here and charm person. So we'll switch, topple with distance, and we'll swap. I 
I need you to come under my car and look at it, please. 